Suppose we wish to determine the value on a T distribution with a specified degree of freedom. To do this, we need the T PDF command. And the structure of the command is as follows. You go ahead and find the T PDF command, then you type in the value, then a comma, and then the degrees of freedom. So for example, suppose we wish to determine the Y coordinate associated with X equal 1 on the T distribution curve with 10 degrees of freedom. Well, here's how you can do it. If you hit second and vares, this brings you to the distribu distribution menu. If you scroll down to TPDF and call up the command, you can go ahead and bring that back to the home screen. Then you give it the X value, which in our case is 1, and then a comma, and then the degrees of freedom, which are 10. And then hit Enter. So the Y coordinate is approximately 0.23 on a t-distribution with 10 degrees of freedom. Now if you wish to graph this curve on a calculator, you may do so as well. And here's how. You select y equals, go back to distributions, select the tpdf command again, type in x for the value, and then the degrees of freedom. And then close it off. Now the window is not set up to see the graph unless we make some adjustments and the tpdf command does not automatically size up your windows. So using values and tables, uh, we can help uh, set up our window. But the main difficulty is getting the y min and the y max values to work for us. So to do this, we're going to use the tpdf command again. We're going to exploit the fact that the t distribution is symmetric around 0, and its highest point is located at x equals 0. The graph is never negative, so any value 0 or less will work for the y min. So we're going to go ahead and hit Window. And we'll go ahead and type in our X min, negative 4, X max at 4. And the scaling will keep at 1. Now our Y min, we're going to set to be negative 0.2. And then our Y max is where the T PDF command comes in again. We're going to go back to the distributions, select T PDF, and tell it to find the value at 0 when you have 10 degrees of freedom. We'll go ahead and do the Y scaling at 0.1 and then we'll hit graph. And here is a picture of what the T distribution with 10 degrees of freedom looks like. Now you may use the trace uh, option to trace out this curve or if you want to find specific values you may do so as well under the value command and this is how you can use the t pdf command on the calculator